What's up everybody? First name Greg, last name Vlog Show. And today we are at Midsummer Scream. Essentially it's Halloween in the summer. It's for people who can't wait. Today is a Friday. It's here in Long Beach at the Convention Center. Um, it happens all weekend. But um, I'm only here on Friday, so let's go check it out. Haunt right there, Ghostface. What's up, Ghostface? So we have Jason over there and little Michael Myers hanging out together. How about that? Is that father and son? So the first thing I'm going to do is go through this walkthrough art experience. Let's check it out. Here we go. I don't expect any jump scares through this one. I do like the colors. This might be very slow moving. Got the vibes, got the spooky vibes going on. There we go. We got the story right here. I don't know if you'll be able to see that, but if you want to read that, pause that. Oh. This is already getting fun. We got another little setup over here. Ooh, someone's getting married. Oh, oh, oh. I like the wedding cake. That's awesome. Piano player, or organ player. That's an organ player. Getting hitched. I really like these guys. The mustache. This is cool, but it's a little slow moving. So this is a gypsy carnival. Sorry. Fortune teller. Ah. Oh, this is pretty awesome. Now remember, this is just an art display. It's not really meant to scare anybody. I like the projected skulls. It's cool. All right, exit, exit through the gift shop. This guy. Ooh -ha. Get me get out of the light there. That's awesome looking, man. This is what I dig about these things. I mean, there's so many cool little things to look at like this. Look at this. We got the backlight going on, so you can't really see it too well. But that's awesome. This is my first time going to one of these, so I don't know what to expect. Kind of just going about this as a newcomer would, I guess, because I am. Those are the twins from The Shining right there. Ooh, spooky. There's a guy. Ooh. Oh. 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 <laughs> now that was freaking awesome. Get these clowns. Oh. Whoa. Ooh. All right. Going down. I think this is where all the main attractions are. Kind of getting a little scared, guys. Just a little scared. Yeah, this is where the action is, right here. Oh yeah. Look at this display. Oh my god. This, this is amazing. Look at that. Look at this. This is so fun. So incredible. I love all these moving characters they have. This is at the front right when you come in. It's got all these moving pumpkins and I don't know what is that a dragon pumpkin or a pumpkin dragon? And oh man, here he comes. Now this is where you go if you want the real, the real deal. Look at this. Look at that. That's a wall of mask. Amazing mask at that. Look at that. Look at this. That's pretty incredible. 
That is incredible. Look at this guy. That's that's some professional looking stuff going on here. I mean, look at this. The realism is amazing. This guy's got a little hat. This guy's got a little hat. They get creepier. Look at that. They get creepier as they go down. Just right away, you know you get your money's worth. Look at this. Look at those teeth. The clowns get creepier and creepier and creepier. Look at this. And the realism in this mask. It's just... Incredible. Now I could spend the rest of the day just talking about these masks. But because there's so much more to see in such little time. Look at that. Yeah, they're very versatile too. Yeah, yeah. When you go to most costume stores and you will not see anything like these. I mean, who thinks of this? This is incredible. This is fish coming out of a clown's mouth. I want to get into the mind of these people. Look at this. Now imagine doing dental work on this guy. Okay, I gotta pry my say, myself away from this. This is, I, I could sit here and, and nerd out on all these for the rest of the day. One more for the road. If you love Halloween like me, this is the place to be. This is, this is it. You get your money's worth 100%. These bubbles have like, yeah, just see that? I'm not gonna lie though, this is a bit over overwhelming. Um, I don't know where to go next. Should I go and check out more masks and uh, merch? Should I go this way? Fortunately, today's a short day and I only have four hours, so I better get on whatever I'm gonna do. Let's go. Okay, we're gonna enter this room right here and already there's a bridge up here with a wild looking monkey and a dragon. Look at that dragon. Ooh, a skeleton in armor. Look at that. Dragon's right above him. Let's go inside. Let's see what's up. Got some 12-sided dice. Brings me back to my days of playing D&D. &D. You turn around here and you feel like you're in... Uh, Army of Darkness. This looks like straight out of Army of Darkness. Look at this. I'm not sure which guy is doing the deep talking voice. Certainly not him. It might have been the first guy that I came in. Look at that though. We got this guy up here. We got another spooky. Spooky dragon down here. I just stepped on somebody's foot when I went. <laughs> this guy's pointing down at something. I guess I don't know what he's pointing. At. All right, I found the guy that's talking. Kept hearing this guy in the background. Oh, he can. That's right, sir. Yeah, you're the star. Yeah. You're the star, sir. He's talking to me. I think, I think it's time. To, I think it's time to walk away. That's not just a random audio. That's somebody uh, actually talking to whoever walks up to it. We got a treasure chest here. Doing a little 
Batman over there. Going on to the next. I'm a bit confused by what. What is this supposed to be? Is that ice? Is that supposed to be ice? Someone's trapped in ice? I don't know. Looks like you can spin these, spin these 12 sided dice. Oh, that activates him? That activate him? Let's see. Oh, this thing isn't doing anything. Let's see if this activates it. Spinning that, see what happens. This guy is not doing. Oh, there he goes. His little tentacle eyes are, are moving. And then you got some steam coming out. Look at this. Look at this setup. Walking through here. Look at that guy back there. Look at that. It's amazing. Just a thing. Like, I'm not kidding. This thing goes far back. Oh, look at that. Okay, so there's a line right there. And that there, it's, it's very hard to see through the camera, but that says the Twilight Zone. So I believe that's one of the haunted houses you can walk through. And I hope to get to it later. Oh, and there's another one over here. Scream in the dark. And oh, look at this. Before we get to any of these, we got to look at all this. All right, I guess I'm gonna wait in line for Twilight Zone. Let's do this. Getting closer. Getting closer. This line is going rather slow. But we're getting there. All right, almost at the front of the line. And not wait. It only took like 25, 30 minutes. It's a pretty long line. Yes, you are about to journey to a wondrous land whose boundaries are only limited by your own imaginations. A dimension of sound, a dimension of sight, a dimension of mind. This dimension is beyond that which man knows. The fifth dimension, as vast as space, as timeless as infinity. The year 1957. You all are about to cross into the Twilight Zone. Oh boy, here we go. I think I was set up to go first. <laughs> I think you set me up to go first. I mean... <laughs> <laughs> oh. Okay. 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 I have no idea what we're getting into. Hi! Oh. I'm talking to you. Wow. I don't like you. Oh. Alright, well, I'm out of here. <laughs> oh. about 30 minutes was there was no real jump scares kind of felt like you were gonna get some jump scares and nothing really happened and uh, a little lackluster I'll tell you that I just kind of I was kind of expected something a little longer too it was pretty quick there was about maybe five scare actors in the whole thing and uh, 
Disappointing. This is a pretty cool display. Got Chucky. A lot, got a lot of Chuckies hanging out on the pizza pizza planet. I'm really digging this setup. They got a little shadow kind of moving around up there. It's a little bit of a home alone trick, right? So this one's a little spookier than home alone. I would say a lot of it spookier. So this is another haunted house. Um, after Twilight Zone, I think I just want to wander around. Now, I don't have anybody telling me which one is the best of the haunted houses. They do have a lot of haunted houses here. However, I only have four hours today. It's from six to 10 p.m. So my plan is to go look at the uh, all the merch out in the main room, kind of chill out out there. And if I have time, I might come back and do a couple more haunted attractions. Have to say, this looks pretty cool. This is a really nice setup. We got some, we got some Pennywise dancing. So this actually is not a walkthrough haunt. This is actually a photo shoot. Okay, nice to know. Now this is a really nice one right here too. Full on castle setup. Look at that dragon up there, steaming out some green flames. Look at this, it's pretty amazing. I love it. Wow. <laughs> 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 to the main floor let's check out oh, this is cool they give them they're giving a, a live makeup session here turning her into a, I don't know, a zombie they got movies here and I noticed they got red dawn here videotapes any of you guys still own a VCR out there <laughs> Better off dead. Pretty good movie. Oh yeah. Eight bucks. Shiny. Yeah, I'm glad it came back out here because uh, there's a lot to look at. Ooh. We got spooky snacks. These torsos. Freaking awesome. I had a bad day. That is incredible. I swear the realism is just unbelievable. Wow. I'm not even so sure I can show that on YouTube. It's pretty gruesome, huh? Pretty cool looking dark light posters. Chucky in a rare form. <laughs> I like this. Ghost face. Oh, this is cool. These are all different versions of Bob's Big Boy. <laughs> Doing the Bob's Big Boy pose. Jason, Ghost face. Michael Myers. Beetlejuice. 
That's cool. <laughs> Just a bit overwhelmed. Oh, we got your window. We got a hearse this here. This is the world's oh, first wow. haunted mansion ride for cell yeah. phones. What ah. we do is we put your phone on a car and it gets pushed through 45 feet of spooky art. Your phone will make a video and you'll get to be in the video as a monster! <laughs> We're offering free tickets to ride with every purchase. Purchases start at $5. So you put your cell phone through this, I guess. It goes on a little ride. It films everything in there. All right, interesting. It all happens in a hearse. <laughs> That's awesome. Now I know they're all different properties, and this will probably never happen. But man, would it be nice if someone made that happen. I'm digging these keychains. Jason Voorhees. I like the classics. This is really cool. That's cool. Oh yeah. Jack Skellington. Oogie Boogie. Ghostface. You know, I can't remember this guy's name for the life of me. If you've watched it this far, please leave a comment down below. What's this guy's name again? We've got Chucky. We've got Chucky. Trick or treat. Michael Myers will always be my favorite. I don't care how many different monster movies come out. Michael Myers is always going to be my favorite. Hey, there he is. Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. There's some pretty realistic looking pumpkins. What are these made out of? Excuse me. What, what are these made out of? Oh, they're foam. Oh, they're foam? Yeah, so they're all fake. And they're right. Foam. That's so cool. That's awesome. These are really cool. That's awesome. You know, I'm working on the uh, working on original pieces throughout the show. Oh, nice. So these are all hand drawn. Yes, they start out. Nice. Scanning. Then I scan them in and make the prints. Which is yeah. Cool. I like your style, man. Yeah. Well, actually, I drew all of them. Is, there, is that the like the three different? Isn't there like many versions of the Necronomicon? Is that what that is? So I there might be different versions from. Different I think versions. there is. I think there's some. I think I'm only familiar with that. Version. Right, right, yeah. But um, she she's a big evil deadhead. So me too. She might have uh, gone back and like found discrepancies <laughs> between Evil Dead One. Right. What are the chocolate chips made out of? Clay. Clay. That's cool. Just came up with this idea out of nowhere. Yeah. Just kind of. <laughs> I love it. It's cool. I was cool. looking like cookie monsters and then I was like, cookies that are monsters. Right, right. <laughs> I love it. I love the little popsicles too. Thank you. It's cool. It is a bit overwhelming. All these booths, there's like tons of booths, and everyone has just awesome art displays. Feed me, Seymour! Feed me all night long. I used to watch this movie so much when I was a kid. Oh yeah, I love that movie. It was pretty much on repeat. <laughs> <laughs> this is all clay, I assume? Um, I still get everything out of clay, and then I mold it and cast it in resin. Oh, so okay. So it's all resin right now. Nice. <laughs> I saw Beetlejuice walk by earlier. Oh, really? Yeah. He was doing the character and everything. I'm surprised to see so many ghost faces. <laughs> oh, he's got a knife. T-shirts. Get your T-shirts. These are very small. These are probably, yeah, kid size. Still cool, though. Yeah, that's awesome. Alright, Stimpy. That's amazing. 
So Ren and Stimpy was a huge part of my childhood. And I love the fact that he's just creepy as hell here. Look at that. And all the details. That is freaking cool. Are you the artist? Are you the artist? I am. Where's, where's, uh, where's, uh, Ren? He's sold. <laughs> He's sold, yeah, okay. He's sold at the, uh, Monster Palooza. Okay, because yeah. I would say this, that is so amazing. I love that. Sorry, I'm just fanboying out, I guess, no, over no. this. That's awesome. Oh, I love that. Do you, do you just make them all one original? Or do yeah. One, oh. All one up, not from a mold. Yeah. Not from a yeah. mold, okay. Yeah, as a matter of fact, uh, that's how Ren and Stim Stimpy started out as a oh, nice. little metal armature. Oh, I welded it together. Cool. Uh, like this one here is a beholder, which turned into that, which is here too. I haven't gotten that far yet, but. What's your Instagram? Uh, Moldy Creations. Moldy? Yeah. Creations? I love this. And the cups, you just kind of add on to just cups already made is that how you uh, do it every, yeah i buy the mug pre-made from the dollar tree and then right. just look right on top nice of it. Yep. okay okay cool. so if you wanted to check him out he's on instagram freaking awesome to get that young Frankenstein shirt. And anything Gene Wilder. Oh no, this is a nice setup right here. Look at this. This is a really nice display. There they are, Ghostbusters. I've actually met a couple of these guys at one of the local parades in Long Beach. So they're known as the LA Ghostbusters. But there's concern that there might be a security for So if you see any of these anomalies out on the floor in any of these receptors, show them your level one key card. These are all really nice looking sculptures. Chopper. These are cool. Get some socks of your favorite scary movies. Here's Johnny. American Psycho. Yeah. These are cool. Mike Myers. Shh. Yeah. You won't know that we're recording him. Electrified monster machine? I don't know why this display is here. It's not really selling anything. I it's, it's cool. I like it. So this booth here is all about Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Everything Texas Chainsaw Massacre. Man, I have never seen a They Live mask ever in my life. This is freaking awesome. This is a movie that I watched on repeat when I was a kid. Wow, that's awesome. It's pretty cool, they got an Eddie mask. Iron Maiden. 
Gremlins. So question, is Gremlins a Christmas movie? Let me know down in the comments. All right, so I got an hour and a half left and there's no way I'm gonna be able to see all this. Thinking about going back and doing one of the hunted attractions. It's just a matter of finding out which one I want to do. Oh my God, it's Ghostface again. It's my pal Ghostface. How's it going? Oh God, he has come prepared. He has come very, very prepared. Look out guys. This is really cool. You guys are awesome. Just like a Beetlejuice? Beetlejuice! 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 I think you have to disappear now, right? Alright, I think I have chosen the one I'm gonna go in next. It's the Haunted Castle. This one looks so amazing, so let's do it. Luckily, the line does not look as long in this one, so things are looking good. See that they really nailed the atmosphere in here. Got a lot of screaming, darkness, scare actors running around. I approve. But it still was another 20, 25 minutes to wait. Dragon. Oh! oh my! Oh my heart! Oh my! Leave! 
I'm not the only one here. What are you yelling? Oh my god. No. No. Don't. 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 Oh. Okay, this one's good. This one's good, guys. I like this. What? Wait, do we really have to go? Uh, I'm gonna allow someone else to go because I'm not. Okay, maybe I'll just say. Do we really have to go through this? I think so. Oh my god! This is insane! Oh my god! What the? F okay. 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 Oh, jeez. Don't change. Hello. I see you right there and you still made me jump. That was pretty amazing, guys. Thank you. God! <laughs> All right. What the Okay. Heck? Holy cow, that one made up for it. So the Twilight Zone one, it was very kid-friendly. I don't want to knock it too much because there are a lot of little kids here. But that one, the castle, was freaking amazing. I have never experienced anything like that before, and I am not even joking. Now, near the end, you couldn't see anything, but we had to walk through foam, very thick foam. I mean, you're squeezing, claustrophobic, walking through this foam, because you don't even know which way you have to go, and then you're like, wait, I have to go through this? That was good. That was good. Um, even when I saw the scare actors, they still scared me. They knew what they were doing. That was good. Oh man, what a way to end this night. Get the random land stand, there's Justin Scarred. Didn't even know. There he is. Remember that. Justin, how are you doing, man? I'm doing very good. How about I'm you? Great, man. <laughs> and I do remember this guy. Yeah, look at that. I remember yeah. that. And now he has a whole playset. We have a life size action figure. What do you need next? I, I, well, I love the Scooby Doo. I love the Scooby Doo eyes. We have a secret passage. You do, yeah. <laughs> There's even a secret passage for me to escape. Nice. So I have a way nice. To escape back there. So there's right. secret passages. Mr. Frank is like, what more do you need? <laughs> look at that. And you're lucky because look, it's empty. It's I know, full. I know. It is so it's it's almost ten, so yeah. well wait, no, it's not oh, almost no, it's ten. Not. It's oh man. Two. How long have we been here? How long have we been here? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Time to go home. Yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. So awesome, man. Nice to meet you, dude. Yeah, dude. Nice to meet you, man. Take it easy. Have fun. Look at us. We're shaking yeah, hands. Shaking hands. Woo. Making friends. Shaking Make hands. It, making friends. Oh, There's a true man of the hour right there. That's some nice realism. Here's Johnny. Thank you for joining me in Midsummer Stream, ladies and gentlemen. If you like this video, you're also gonna like this video right over here. Check that video out. I'll see you over there. Bye-bye.